500 metres course we know Paul the form out of that race with Rebels Romance he of course came out and won the Shima Classic last weekend yeah he did won it really well as well did uh, Rebels Romance so there is a bit of um, form there Nick's gone 11 2 3 5 so he's gone uh, a little bit rougher as well happy together at 9.1 to beat the favourite beauty eternal beauty joy and then he's put nimble nimbus there on a minor line so that was next. Money still coming for Super Sunny Singh on a place line. Now into 4.9, so there is a bit of place money for him. Uh, Beauty Eternal has been pretty solid in odds on. He was, he got out to just close to even money, but he's now back into 1.8. So plenty of support. There's plenty of support about the other horse too. Beauty Joy, Beauty Eternal, Beauty Joy at 6.3. Near the clear favourite, so... Uh, Beauty Quinella is how the punters are going. That's as far as the favourites are. Two to beat three. And uh, other ones now happy together has come into single figures. He's into 9.3 as well. As far as the plays are uh, going, going to go Beauty Eternal with uh, Encountered. I think we'll get a good run just in behind. And Jenny's long shot as well. Tars Dragon. So a 2 7 10 Quinella Quinella plays. So 7 and 10, both good pricings behind their favourite. He's at 1.8. And the story with, of course, Russian Emperor, who was supposed to go to Dubai, was, uh, um, I believe, the uh, club phoned up, the Dubai Racing Club, and said, so we, we've got space, but now we, we don't have space. And then Douglas was supposed to uh, uh, line him up in a trial at Happy Valley. He didn't enter him for the trial, and then they phoned back and said, well, we've got space for him now, and he didn't end up going over there, Jenny. So uh, not ideal. It's been a, a while between runs uh, without a trial. Well, it certainly has, but, um, you know, what he, he's in a decent race here and he's picked up $48 million, so I don't know that we can complain too much. <laughs> <laughs> Not indeed. Uh, Hugh Bowman riding here looking for a group to uh, double. There is uh, Beauty Eternal on screen. Beauty Joy Paul, is he going to be a bit closer maybe from barrier one? Well, it just depends how... Look, he can be slow away sometimes. He's really light-mouthed horse and he's he can be a little bit finicky at times, Beauty Joy. But on, a, on his going day, we know he's very good. Uh, he's There is lots of money for him. He's coming to six now, so the money keeps coming for Beauty Joy, the clear second favourite. So maybe he will be. Punters may be thinking from the barrier one, uh, Brenton can get him out and get him into a nice position, which which uh, he can do if he jumps. He's just, sometimes he's just, just a little bit finicky. Moving in well at the 1,600 metres for the second of our Group 2 features this afternoon here at Shards. And the favourite is Beauty Eternal at 1.8. It's the Chairman's Trophy with Mark McNamara. It is. Thank you, Tom. There's money for Red Lion at 22. Now, he has one on a rain-affected track, so perhaps there's something to do with that. But it's not a rain-affected track. It's still rated as good. It's not like it's a quagmire or anything, but uh, still a good rated track for race number eight. But uh, Red Lion backed on a wind line into 22 to 1. Two out, happy together, and a Super Sunny Singh. There's a heap of uh, Quinellas going through Super Sunny Singh too, so he may come in yet on a win line. Chairman's Trophy, money now for Beauty Joy, lights up green, money for the 7-2, and they're off to a good start at the 1600 metres, and a healthy, happy going forward, red line showing pace, so two sword point and Beauty Eternal. Running fifth is Money Catcher from Taj Drag and Nimble Nimbus. Next is encountered from Beauty Joy on the rail and then came Happy Together, Russian Emperor and Super Sunny Singh and the best peach are the last two. A healthy, happy in a line of three. He's the widest sword point on the rail and Beauty Eternal between them third from Red Lion. He's running fourth and Taz Dragon's in a good spot, fifth on the fence. Then came Money Catcher and three winders encountered from Beauty Joy. Three quarters to Nimble Nimbus and then Happy Together. Two lengths to Super Sunny Singh, same again Russian Emperor. And the best peaches a length away last of all. Sword Point with 800 metres to go. Leads by three quarters over Healthy Happy. Three wide as Red Lion, fourth the entire side as Taj Dragon. Fifth is Beauty Eternal. Three wide and hard ridden as encountered. Beauty Joy's had a very cushy run on the rail. Then came Money Catcher, Happy Together, Nimble Nimbus, Super Sunny Singh, Russian Emperor, and the best peach, the leader is Sword Point. Healthy Happy's a half a length away. Two lengths to Beauty Eternal, he's pushed along. Then came Taj Dragon, Red Line and Beauty Joy. He's into the open from Happy Together. Beauty Eternal claims a lead from Healthy Happy. Beauty Joy's coming after the other beauty. It's Eternal in front of Joy. They go to battle again. It's Eternal and Joy. Joy's going to beat Eternal today and it's Abdullah and 
beauty, joy. What a result. Tony Cruz, Chairman's Trophy in 1500 in Hong Kong. Beauty, joy beat beauty eternal and either red line or nimble nimbus. Then came Sword Point, Taj Dragon, Super Sunny Singh, Healthy Happy Money Catcher, Russian Emperor, and then Happy Together, the best peach and encountered.